Well, folks, here it is. It's done. Looking beautiful with the white siding on it and the black trim. This is our 10 by 16 uh, Simcoe style building with a nice big 8 by 10 porch on the front. Loving the contrast of the white siding with the black trim. Lots of windows here. Just going to do a bit of a tour around this building. Look at that. That's looking so good. Coming around the back. Nice big 4x3 window on the back as well. You can see how we take our time. We're really patient. Cock all these seams up. I really like this color. It's not like a stark white. It's got a bit of a muted tone. I know I mentioned that before. But we got another one of our 4x3 windows here. And as we come around, there's a nice big porch on the front. My buddy Kev was asking, what's the point of this post? It's kind of in the way. It's really for snow load. So this is a significant roof on here. We got an eight foot span. If it was a six footer, we could do without that. But in order to make it stronger and we build everything heavy duty, that's in order to hold that up. But we do have a nice open front on this porch. Everything on the porch is PT with the exception of the roof. So it's pressure treated skids pressure treated floor joists, pressure treated deck boards, pressure treated posts. And then we have some pine on the bottom side here. So again, white siding with black trim. My wife's bugging me. She said we should have put a window there, but uh, maybe we'll do that on the next one. And then when we come in here, we got a beautiful wall of windows, four foot by 12 inch Transom windows over four foot by three foot horizontal sliders. Again, these are Johnny from Northern Performance Windows and Aurelia hooks these up. These are low E coated, argon filled, modern high efficiency windows. This is a beautiful package, folks. This is sort of like um, the PS de resistance, if you will. So we've added a lot of features to this building, even though it's a small space. We got a 10 by 16 here. But when you get the Simcoe dormer, you get the extra roof height for about two thirds of the roof and it still tapers down to a 412 slope on the back. And then we have another, you know, four by three here. So when you look at the building, I don't know, imagine this is, this is your water view or it's looking over to your fields or you just like looking at the forest. That's my favorite view. That's lots of window in a 10 by 16 building. There's no point doing more than this. I do get people that ask me to do a four foot by four foot window. We could do that, which brings the window down to about this level, but then it's not useful space underneath those windows. You can't get a sofa, a bed, a countertop or a whatever underneath there. So this is my recommended window for any of our buildings, which is four wide and three tall. But as you can see, all the seams are cocked white trim everywhere where it's necessary just got a couple little things to tidy up and the boys will have this clean this building is going to bancroft up to uh, maple leaf on friday so greg's going to come pick it up and we're going to drop it off up there for that version of canadian cottage country it's going to sit uh, the lot up there is about halfway between maynooth and combermere i don't know if you guys are familiar with that region we're going to build one almost identical to this and it's going to go to King Carden as well. So no matter where you live, we'll have something fairly close to you. Also like to point out, you can see just like your house, we have aluminum ventilated soffits here. This building does have baffle vents in it and a fully uh, ventilated roof cap. There is a gasket on the edge of the roof. Like there's a lot in this building that you don't see that I'd love you to come and have a peek and have a chat with me so we can explain all this to you because there's just so much going on here that you're not gonna see from the finished product within the walls and that's how it's supposed to be. These are built to a very high standard. Our quality control level is, um, you know, hopefully up to a standard that meets yours as well. And I'll, I'll be perfectly frank with you, we don't build the cheapest buildings here in the province. But man, oh man, do we ever build some nice ones. That is gorgeous. I'm so happy with how this turned out and I can't wait to get it on the ground so we can show some of you. So this is a 10 by 16 Simcoe. White steel siding, black trim, white windows, plus a nice big eight by 10 porch. That looks like a pretty good place to sit and have a beer, doesn't it? 
Hey, check us out at highlandoutbuildings.com, folks. Or you can call me anytime, 705-309-9088. Cheers.